All right, guys, welcome back to another Ice Academy YouTube video. In this video, we're gonna discuss, we're gonna uh, explain, I'm gonna try to explain how to smoke off B side um, to get in B side more easy, easier. Um, of course, a lot of it goes along with a lot of pop flashers. I would never um, hit B solo through tunnels. I will always try to go to mid to B, so the CT side has to cover two angles. If you're not in that option, um, these two smokes or three smokes will be very useful. Um, all right, guys, let's hop into the first smoke right away. All right, so the first smoke is a very easy smoke. Um, this smoke is only useful. These smokes are only useful if you have a B spawn and you have you have fast access to sight. What you need to do is you see this edge right here. Is you're gonna walk up towards that 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 edge right there. Um, so it will go past this wall right here. Um, what this smoke allows you to do if is if someone is holding it from here um, or even backside right here or even here, um, it will it will it will provide you a little bit of a cover. And this smoke will also if it lands right here, this smoke will also give you access to car without getting spotted from site itself. So if someone is just just jumped on on on, on platform, they will not see you. Um, so you can clear car, then go to the rest of site. So that's the first smoke. It's a very useful and easy smoke to throw. Um, and what I think it's it's a very reliable smoke. You have to practice a little bit because sometimes you will hit this wall right here, and the smoke will land right here. So your team has to push through the smoke like Stu K does, and that's not very helpful or useful if you cannot see shit. And they can because they can see some shadows. Um, so they, sh they, they just can spam everything. Alright, so that's the first smoke. Let's hop right into the second smoke. Alright, so the second smoke is almost thrown the same way. Only the angle is a little bit different. The first smoke is you're going to throw it from here. The second smoke is you're going to throw it from here. You're almost going to line these two up with each other. You're going to walk forward. This smoke will allow the smoke to land a little bit further. Um, I had to let it go a little bit later than, than now, um, but it's almost perfect. This smoke will give you access to platform without getting seen from mid or from doors. Um, so you can easily kill window um, or side itself. Of course, once you're here, you have to be careful that they are not holding this angle. But of course, there's a door smoke for it, and I'm going to explain it how to throw that one. It's a very easy one. But yeah, that smoke will give you access. If you if you let go a little bit later, it will land exactly right here. As you can see, there's no gap whatsoever, so you can cl you can clear um, window from this angle. So you have very easy access. Um, so you can actually split B. So one is going car, the other one is going platform, and so you can set up a crossfire right away. And of course, if you smoke door off, B is yours. All right, let's go to the last one. All right, so the last one is, of course, a door smoke. Um, if you decide not to throw these ones, the, the, the next most important smoke is, of course, the door smoke. Um, still, a lot of guys will fuck it up and will just, like, um, throw it right away. I'm going to throw it with a flash. It will bounce back. So what you need to do is you need to aim at this corner right here, and it will land outside door. So it will hit this, hit that, and... Because of the angles, it will land right here. Why do you throw it like this? The reason is they cannot, they can still boost up. But normally, if you play solo, um, you can look over the smoke if it lands a little bit further. So if you throw it like that, like this, there you go. It's harder to 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 see over it. You can jump and spam, but. If you walk close by, so if you walk close towards the smoke, they will not, they will not able to see your ass. Um, so yeah, that's the that's the the third one. There is a last one, and I'm gonna show it to you right now. All right, so the last one is more of an after plan smoke. Uh, this smoke is of course um, for uh, window. There's not a specific way to throw this one. Um, you just have to practice it a lot of times to, to throw it right. Um, Again, it's more of an after plan smoke, so you plant uh, you will plant a bomb right here. If you want to have tunnel control, if you want to have window control, you're gonna throw it, uh, plant it right here or even right here. 
but I always will plant it right here so we can fall back towards tunnel um, so we have more cover uh, and less angles to peek. So yeah, the last one is of course the after plant smoke um, so they will not rush in right away. Um, even with the pop flash I discussed, I explained in the last episode, um, I will not go through that smoke. I will wait until it's, it, it disappeared. Um, and when I go up, the tunnel will not be flashed because they will stand here. Um, as you can see, the flash will land right there. Um, I will not be blinded and I still have full vision over the bomb. Um, so that's why I always will plant the bomb right there. Alright guys, that's it for this video. I'm now going to show you the shot. How it looks like if you have smoked off everything. Alright guys, so every smoke has been thrown. Um, the smoke will disappear eventually, but we will keep on talking. So as you can see, you have clearly um, two sections of B site. So you have this section right here and that section right there. Um, so you can easily just walk up towards here, clear car and go up. Um, so and if someone is standing right here, you will not get shot from that angle. Um, and you can walk up very easy um, for a door. And of course, the after plant smoke for that. Um, and this smoke right here, if you decide to rush through and clear out window. <clears throat> All right, guys, that's it for this video. I want to thank you everyone so much for watching again. You know what to do. Leave a thumbs up if you like this video. If you like the series, leave a thumbs down if you don't like the series. But also, if you leave the thumbs down, please leave a comment below explaining what you want to see, why you left the thumbs down. Um, and I will see you guys all in the next video. If you love the series and want to see even more, please hit the subscribe button with the notification bell so you will get notified when I upload. Um, I will always try to upload once a week. Uh, sometimes it's not possible because of my work, but I always try to do it. Um, yeah, guys, that's it for this video. I'm MCIs, and I will see you guys all in the next video.